And it would seem that the Viking raiding party have indeed found someone of value. The wife of a local thane, perhaps. Perhaps too late, a couple of fighting men have decided to oppose the Vikings and hopefully rescue their hostage. But outnumbered, the men of Gloucester have to retreat. The men of Gloucester have returned, strung a bow and are trying to harry the Viking ship. And a horn is sounded, hopefully to bring more defenders, more people who can help rescue this hostage and stop this raid before they get away into open water. And from out a small inlet, some fighting men have requisitioned a couple of old fishing boats. One of the brave men of Gloucester is trying to board the Viking ship, but oh! <laughs> But he seems to be okay, and thankfully he can swim. Another boarding attempt.
Once again, one of the small requisitioned fishing boats has come alongside the Viking longship and is trying to board it. One of the Vikings has now been forced overboard. The fighting has died down. It would appear that the men of Gloucester are victorious. And the horn sounds again, this time in celebration. The hostage is safe. An uncertain future of servitude in North Africa or somewhere other far-flung land is now not a likely possibility.